first corner, left hand, slow left hand, third gear, maximum acceleration, downhill section, first right hander here, bumpy, needs a stable car, needs warm tires to be fast. We come down to Hudsonbach, combination of five corners, one behind the next. Very important to have a stable car, important to have a good front axle to place the car, use the maximum space at the exit. Hochreichen, right left combination brings us down to Quiddelbacher Brücke, full acceleration, close to the rail on the right side. Full throttle, up to Flugplatz, jump, car comes down, double right hander, maximum speed at the exit. We go down to Schwedenkreuz, 6 gear, downhill section. The first jump is on the straight, keep the car straight, then turn in to Schwedenkreuz, more than 200 kph, hard braking zone. Arenberg, third gear, long right hander, perfect exit, down to Fuchsröde, full speed, six gear, in the compression we should reach around 260 kph, it's perfect, Arenauer Forst, combination of four corners from fast to slow, most important one is the last one, be not too fast in the entrance and to be early on the throttle for the exit. We go down to Metzgesfeld, double left hander, fifth gear, fourth gear, second one is a little bit slower. From here on we reach the longest downhill section, means that the end will reach around 700 degrees on the front axle brake discs. It's a very technical part, lots of corners, you have to trust the car, trust the grip. Triple right, you need to trust all the aerodynamic downforce. Here we reach the slowest corner on the track, second gear. Accelerate out, full acceleration, two, three, fourth gear. Come down to right side, reduce the speed, close to the ball on the right side, use all the grip, ex mühle exit here, needs a perfect traction, keep the car stable, accelerate up to fourth, fifth gear, fast left hander, full. Down to Bergwerk, third gear, long corner, very important because it brings us to a long uphill part to Kesselchen. From here on, full throttle, full speed. Also, the following left hander here, absolutely full, about 230 kph is perfect on the exit. All the way up, we are reaching. Following left hander very fast, Mutkurve coming from the outside, maximum space. Right hander, car gets light, keeps the car straight, brake for Klostertal. Another very long right hander, very important to keep the front axle stable, no understeering. We go up to Carousel. Very well known section at the Nordschleife. Car needs to be stable. Very important, a good damper, spring setup. And we go up to Hohe Acht. First the fast left hander, fourth gear, use the space. Then left and right, this is Hohe Acht. Now we're reaching a very technical section, which means just corners. No real straights between the corners. Always lots of work for the driver. You need to trust the car, you need to have a stable car. 
use the curves, use all the space. The tires are warm, perfect grip. We go down to Brünchen, very well known section. In the race, lots of spectators here. Also, here using all the space, also using the curb. At the exit of Brünchen, always take care for oversteer situations. Okay, we have to counter steer a little bit. Ice curve is the same, very bumpy. Use the space and accelerate out. We come down to Plants Garden. Another little jump. Car jumps, set down, double right, very fast. Down to the left. Plants Garden 2, fifth gear, and as a jump, come down. Very fast section, perfect aerodynamic, is important. Now we are at six minutes, which means the lap comes to its end. No more mistakes. Be fast, but not too fast. Schwalbenschwanz, another very bumpy section. Stable car. Come to Kalingenkopf. Double right hander. Very important for the long straight. It's the last right hander before the long straight to the Höhe. Means we need all the exit speed we can get no. on the long straight. Maximum acceleration. Thank you. 